to Common Sense TV. I'm your host, the Doctor of Common Sense. Target saw how well it went for Bud Light, and they decided to get in on the festivities. So they have displayed in front of their store when you walk in. They tried to move it a couple of times, but a couple of people caught it. It's been moved because here is where it used to be. We found the pride section. It's in the very back of the store. It's been completely rearranged. And I didn't think that these were true. Look closely. It says light binding effect for light binding here at Target for your kids. Racks the baby ones, toddler pride leggings, the toddler tutu for all your kids going to pride parades with drag queens. It's just disturbing. You know, I'm glad they moved it to the back of the store because no kid should be seeing this in front. It, here's the tucking one piece bathing suit hidden in the back. And here's another one. Here is the, the tucking bottoms to the matching binding bathing suit top. The 4th of July section. As you can see, they love America. Do you see her? But the folks at Target thought it would be a good idea to promote these children tuck underwear or bikinis for children and for adults, by the way. Chest binders, because it would not it works so well for uh the folks over at uh Bud Light. Bud Light has not learned his lesson. Just saw where Bud Light is still sponsoring your pride events. Go ahead with your bad self. You are going to continually be destroyed. There's a new awakening going on, and people are sick of your trash, and we're not going to tolerate it anymore. But I have a video clip of a beautiful, beautiful site. It's some Joe Biden and Barack Obama supporters, and they're going into Target's helping theirself to the merchandise. Well, these are the folks who support them. This is the, some of their own supporters going in, destroying their store by just taking stuff. Don't judge them. They have a right to do it. They was raised in an impoverished neighborhood. They have to go in and get things. Uh, it's called a shopping spree. I believe it was a game show. It created a new game show. It called... Grab as much of this crap as you possibly can. Did they get any pride material when they were running out? Matter of fact, let's make Target just a free store. No more purchasing stuff at Target. You get it for free. Take a look at this video. We'll be right back. So it, I think they're going on a shopping spree. Look at this. You got a whole basket of stuff. This is Target. Just helping yourself. No conscience. Joe Biden... Barack Obama supporters. These are Democrats. It's a well-known fact. Go, go to Pride uh, flag right there. Oh, isn't that lovely? You did take some Pride things. Good for you. You wear it proudly too, damn it. They tore down the Pride rack. Oh, my God. Look at this heifer just running out here with stuff. No conscious, no man. Look, he's going to get some free stuff. They got masks on. That's why, you know, look at this. Just loading up crap. <laughs> this is absurd, man. But this is what happens. When Democrats run things, when progressive and liberal, they're riding a bicycle through there. Look at this, like, what's going on? He just, nobody is spending money in here. Welcome, Target. If this is your supporters in here robbing you blind. No, I'll take it back. These are Donald Trump supporters, I'm sure. This is the MAGA crowd. Does these people look like MAGA crowd to you? This look like, look at this. This is, this is absurd, man. This is Target. Do I feel sorry for Target? I sure do not. This is they support. They in here just getting baskets load of stuff, as much stuff as possible. Nobody's just shopping. Nothing. Now I have a another clip. This is a mother, and I use that term very, very loosely. She says that she took her non-binary seven-year-old. I don't know if it's a girl or a boy because it's non-binary. She doesn't say. Took him it that day, whatever it is, to Target. And they saw the display in there, the uh, pride display in the non-binary seven-year-old. Wonder how they came to that conclusion. The non-binary seven-year-old says, look, mom, they're celebrating me. And then she pretends to fake cry and says, now if I bring her, I mean, I'm sorry, it in here, 
it won't even see and celebrate the pride, won't be able to see everybody celebrating pride. Then she calls the people who don't want that in there terrorists. So I thought we didn't negotiate with terrorists. We could do so much better. So moving. So I just walked into Target and the um, right behind me here where you see all these lovely swimsuits, that's where the pride display used to be. And I came in here two days ago and my seven-year-old who's non-binary saw it and said, look mom, it's pride. Look, they're gonna celebrate me. And because some people complained and um, threw some stuff to the ground, or I don't know what happened, they have moved to the pride section to the back of the store. So the next time my seven-year-old comes to Target, or rather, I can't bring them here anymore, at least for the entire month of June, because if they walk in, and all the other people who walk in and go, where'd it go, are going to realize that they are being successful in trying to erase them. We could do so much better than this. We're not supposed to negotiate with the terrorists. We can do so much better so than let's this. Let's keep it up. Target says they want the same treatment you gave Disney. They want the same treatment that you gave Bud Light. They want some of that same treatment. Guess what, Target? You can get that same treatment. I, I was shopping at Target. I, I, I will not spend a dime in Target now. Target says that you damn right we're going to do this. It's Pride Month. And you're going to celebrate with us. We want you to come in and spend your money to help promote this. We got the tuck outfits, the tough tuck bikinis for little children in case a little boy wants to tuck his stuff. Grown men can tuck their stuff too. This is lovely. And I saw Bud White. I saw Bud Wise. I think you're up to 15 billion. You haven't suffered enough, right? Mm-hmm. Well, good luck with that. Because we have seen, you have seen, we're sick of it. And what I find laughable about this is that the women at The View and some of these other people say, this is wrong for us to protest. See, it was good for you when you were protesting and trying to destroy conservative businesses. Now you're getting some of your own medicine. Open up wide. Here's some more medicine, Target. You didn't learn. But why is it having learning either? I just saw a but why is, but why is it still giving money over to those who are supporting the pride? Good luck with that. I'm going to send some more of these Biden, Obama shoppers in there when you let me know what business it is. Because I'll send these folks in there because they support Joe Biden. They believe in giving away free stuff. Uh, Barack Obama believes in giving away free stuff. And your supporters are coming to get their free stuff.